Construction of our new space installation, designated NL1, has proceeded swiftly and is nearing completion. However, most of the defense systems are still being installed, which means its shields are only partially functioning and no active targeting systems. Additionally, the Victory Class Star Destroyer Stalwart has left the area to rendezvous with a final convoy which is carrying Thai starfighters intended for the station. We've received intelligence that the Rebels alongside the Bakuni Pirates are planning a surgical strike on the station whilst it is still relatively defenseless, in the hopes of thwarting our efforts to bring order to this sector. This cannot be allowed. You will be the flight leader in an assault gunboat designated Tau-1 and will patrol the area along with our other Thai squadrons. The modified frigate Ludwig and the modified corvettes Horvus will support and help provide cover for the station. Because NL-1 currently lacks any active defenses, it will be very easy for fighters to make torpedo runs and quickly destroy the station. Therefore, your primary goal will be to ensure the safety of the station by intercepting any torpedo attacks and destroying enemy bombers. Enemy opposition can be expected to be the usual variety of Rebel starfighters and possibly Corvette support. We know the Rebels have a large force in this sector, so watch for any opportunities to disable any craft that may attempt to escape the area carrying any high-ranking officers. We can always use more information which may help us track down this force along with any remaining Bakuni pirates. Construction of the new NL-1 space station is nearly complete but still requires some critical equipment before it's fully online, including its weapon systems. The Victory Class Star Destroyer Stalwart has left the area to rendezvous with the final convoy. In the meantime, however, we must maintain a vigilant patrol whilst the station remains vulnerable. The modified frigate Ludwig and the modified corvettes Horvus will maintain a close patrol around the station. Assault gunboats Tau and our remaining TIE squadrons will intercept and engage any potential attackers. Without weapon systems and full shields, the station will be especially vulnerable to torpedo attacks, so intercepting any bombers and incoming torpedoes are your top priority. We must hold out long enough until the stalwart returns with the final convoy. Rebel attack force jumping in. Intercept those Y wings before they launch too many torpedoes. This is six. I'm having trouble over here. This is six. I'm heavily damaged. One, attacking craft dead ahead.
over here. This is two. I'm having trouble over here. This is far. Don't you have me sighted? This is far. I'm engaged in defensive. Wow. You have a pack of friendly craft. This is four. I've got a start to firing at me. This is two. I'm avoiding my attack run. This is four. I'm avoiding my attack run. This is five. I'm avoiding my attack run. Good kill. Hey, one. Keep your distance. This is four. I'm heavily damaged. This is three. All right, I'm waiting off. This is five. I'm good. This is three. I'm engaged in defensive. This is Hey, one, keep your distance. Rebel Corvettes have been destroyed. Good work. I'm ejecting! Hey, one, keep your distance.
station has survived and the construction work can now continue. Excellent. You have helped capture the rebel transports. They should provide useful information on rebel activities. Enter the hangar, Tower 1. Report to the debriefing room at once. Well done. The rebel strike force was repelled. The station suffered several torpedo hits but has otherwise weathered the attack well and repairs are already underway and its defense systems should be fully operational shortly. The Victory Class Star Destroyer Stalwart has delivered a new supply of TIE Starfighters for both the station and our own depleted forces, so we should be at full strength to face any further attacks. You helped us capture a group of high-ranking officers. Hopefully we can learn more about further rebel intentions and combat strengths in this sector.